Hello children. A very good morning to all of you. I am Miss Pamela. Today we are going to continue with chapter 8. We will learn how to keep our house and surroundings clean. Proper use of dustbins and how to stay fit. Cleanliness is a state of being clean and free from dirt. Cleanliness is related to hygiene and disease prevention. It is very important to keep our house clean to remain healthy and happy. Regular cleaning will stop the entry of mosquitoes, flies, rats and cockroaches. It becomes very easy if all the family members share the work. Now let's see how to keep our house clean. We should help our parents to keep our house neat and clean. We must sweep our house daily. We must not throw waste paper or rubbish on the ground. We should always use a dustbin. The dustbin should always be kept covered to keep the flies away. We should clean the washroom and wash basins every day. A neat and clean house is a pleasant place to live. A clean surrounding helps in keeping good health. The surroundings of a house should be kept clean so that we can keep our body healthy and away from diseases. Our house and its surrounding should be kept clean always. We should not litter garbage around the house. The garbage must be collected in a covered dustbin and thrown at a proper dumping place. The doors and windows should, should be kept open to allow sunlight and fresh air to come in. Sunlight helps in killing germs. We should not spit here and there. The articles of the house should be dusted every day. We should use a toilet to relieve ourselves. There should be no stagnant water in the drains, pots, coolers and tires which breeds mosquitoes and flies which are harmful for our health. So we should clean our house regularly. Proper use of dustbins. In our house, we collect a lot of rubbish. We must not litter our classrooms and school campus. There are dustbins in every classroom and also around the campus, so we should use them. Chocolate vapors, pencil shavings and other waste should be thrown in the dustbin. It is our duty to keep our classrooms and school clean just like we keep our house clean. How 
टू स्टे फिट फॉर चिल्ड्रेन एक्सरसाइज मीन्स प्लेइंग एंड बींग फिजिकली एक्टिव रनिंग अराउंड जम्पिंग और टेकिंग पार्ट इन स्पोर्ट्स वॉकिंग स्विमिंग जॉगिंग प्लेइंग साइकिलिंग डांसिंग बाइक राइडिंग स्विमिंग आर ऑल्सो एक्सरसाइजेस किड्स हु आर एक्टिव हैव स्ट्रॉगर मसल्स एंड बोन्स दे आर लेस लाइकली टू बिकम ओवर वेट इट मेक्स द बॉडी मोर फ्लेक्सिबल दे ऑल्सो स्लीप बेटर Exercise not only makes our body strong it makes our mind and brain healthy too rest is very important for our body our body needs rest we should sleep early at night we should sleep for at least 8 to 10 hours every day it gives us energy various activities at school and home make us tired we should always take rest when we are tired it makes us fresh again we need sleep to keep us healthy and happy a good sleep helps both body and brain to grow when the kids get enough rest and sleep they get more energy for doing their best yoga is a way to exercise the body and mind at the same time yoga is a group of physical exercises yoga makes our body more flexible it helps us to focus it improves our posture it helps us to sleep better spending too much time watching tv shows videos movies video games and not doing enough physical activity makes children unhealthy and overweight to be more active limit the amount of time spent on watching tv or video games some good habits are we should eat clean and fresh food avoid eating junk food drink at least 8 glasses of water every day the water must be clean our body needs rest so we should sleep for at least 8 to 10 hours every day watching too much of television or looking at the computer for long hours will hurt our eyes playing outdoor games and exercising are also good for our health some important points to remember neat and clean surroundings are pleasing to the eyes we should keep our house school and surroundings clean Never litter any public place or playground. Keep your classroom and school clean. Pick up any rubbish that you find lying on the floor and put it in the dustbin. Do not spit on the road. 
Rest is very important for our body. Exercise makes our body strong and makes our mind and brain healthy. Yoga makes our body more flexible. It improves our posture. Now let's read our EBS book in detail. Chapter 8 Keeping oneself clean, safe and healthy. Page 39 Cleanliness of the house and surroundings. A clean house and clean surroundings help to keep us healthy. Regular cleaning and dusting of the house will stop the entry of flies, cockroaches and lizards. The doors and windows of the house must be kept open to allow sunlight and fresh air to come in. Sunlight helps in killing germs. It is also necessary to keep the area around the house clean. This will prevent germs like flies and mosquitoes from breathing which are harmful for our health. There should be no stagnant water in the drains, pots, coolers, etc. We should not spit here and there. Use only a toilet to relieve yourself. Proper use of dustbins. In our house, we collect a lot of garbage. We should never throw it here and there. The garbage must be collected in a covered dustbin and deposited at a proper dumping place. We must not litter our classrooms and school campus. There are dustbins in every classroom and also around the campus. Use them. Chocolate wrappers, pencil shavings and other waste should be thrown into these dustbins. It is our duty to keep our classrooms and school clean just like we keep our house clean. How to stay fit? Good habits are very important to keep fit. What we learn and practice as children will help us keep healthy and fit even when we become adults. Some good habits are we should eat clean and fresh food. Avoid eating junk food. We should drink at least 8 glasses of water every day. The water we drink must be clean and kept in clean containers. Our body needs rest. We should sleep early at night. We should sleep for at least 8 to 10 hours every day. Watching too much of television or looking at the computer for long hours will hurt our eyes. Do not listen to very loud music or sounds as they harm our ears. Playing outdoor games and exercising are good for our health. They keep us fit and help us to breathe fresh air. Some of them are walking, swimming, jogging, playing, cycling. Yoga is a way to exercise the body and mind at the same time. 
Yoga is a group of physical exercises which began in India a very long time ago. Children, please read the chapter and try to complete all the assignments neatly and correctly. So meet you all again soon. Okay, bye.